dinner in. If we have time, I would like to look for Marjolaine. We have a score to settle. Alistair, what's this? It's a sock. It's a filthy sock. How did it find its way to my bedroll? Maybe it likes you. Socks are sneaky like that. Anyway, it's not mine. It has your name stitched on it. Oh, <laughs> uh, part of Templar training back at the Chantry. The men were uh, always getting their socks mixed up. Anyway, um, sorry about that. I'll take it from you right now. One of my socks is feeling a little damp anyway. A change would be nice. You're going to put it on? It's filthy. And dry. We're not exactly traveling in the lap of luxury here. What hideous habits you've picked up. It shall be... More enemies. So lovely to see you again, my dear. Spare me the pleasantries. I know you're... Oh, you must excuse the shabby accommodations. I try to be a good host, but you see what I have to work with. This country smells like wet dog everywhere. I cannot get this smell out. Even now it is in my hair, my clothes. Ugh. So business-like, your companion. You framed me, had me caught and tortured. I thought that in Ferelden I would be free of you, but it seems I am not. What happened to make you hate me so? Why do you want me dead so badly? Dead? Nonsense. I know you, my Liliana. I know what you are capable of. Four or five men you can dispatch easily. They were sent to give you cause to come to me. And see, here you are. You are so transparent. What are you up to, Marjolaine? Why are you in Ferelden? In truth, you have knowledge that you can use against me. For my own safety, I cannot let you be. It is you think I did not know where you were? Did you think I would not watch, my Liliana? What is she up to, I thought? The quiet life, the peasant clothes, hair ragged and messy like a boy. Uh, this is not her. You were planning something, I told myself, so I watched. But no letters were sent, no messages, you barely spoke to anyone. Clever, Liliana, very clever. You almost had me fooled. But then, you left the Chantry so suddenly. What conclusion should I draw? You tell me. You think I left because of you? You think I still have some plan for... for revenge? You are insane. Paranoid. Oh, is that what you think? If I were you, I would believe nothing she says. Not a one. She will use you. You look at her and you see a simple girl, a friend, trusting and warm. It is an act. I am not you, Marjolaine. I left because I didn't want to become you. Oh, but you are me. You cannot escape it. No one will understand you the way I do, because we are one and the same. Do you know why you were a master manipulator, Liliana? It is because you enjoyed the game. You reveled in the power it gave you. You cannot change or deny this. Thank you. You will not threaten me or my friends again, Marjolaine. I want you out of my life forever. You've caused too much pain for too many, Marjolaine. It ends here. And you think you can kill me like that? I made you, Liliana. I can destroy you just as easily. <laughs>
it because of me. I... I need some time to myself. We... will talk later. I shall do it. Ask away. I shall. Right away. Oh, hello. Is there something you wanted to talk about? It's... it's nothing. I'm fine. I'm just thinking. I can't get what happened out of my head. I'd been in Lothering for years. And she still thought I was plotting against her. She didn't trust me. Maybe she never did. She loved me when she could use me and control me. And now that she can't, she wants me dead. It... It hurts to realize that I never really knew her. You are already helping so much by listening to me. I knew she was ruthless. But I didn't know how far she could go. She is self-serving, cruel. She uses people, then discards them. But that's how she survives in the life she leads. What? Well, what if she's right? What if we're the same? I... I should just have stayed in the Chantry. I could have been wrong about the Maker. I... I know you doubt me sometimes. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Maybe I just tell myself he's there to console myself, to know there's someone watching out for me, to know I'm not alone. But I was. I was alone and desperate when I fled to Ferelden. I went to the only place I knew would take me. I forgot my life as a bard while I was in the cloister. I felt safe. I didn't have to watch my back all the time. That's what made Marjolaine the person she is, don't you see? It ruined her. It will ruin me too. It's already happened. When we killed her, I... I enjoyed it. Seeing her dead gave me satisfaction. But that is no reason to rejoice over her death. That is what she would do. I don't want that. What we're doing. What we've done. Hunted men down. Killed them. Part of me loves it. It invigorates me, and this scares me. I... I feel myself slipping. How can you be so sure? That... That is true. I can always trust you to show me things from a different perspective. I would like to be alone for now. I have many things to consider. Thank you for listening to me. She's a lucky girl, Morrigan. That is not what I meant. She caught your eye. Though looking at her, it is not difficult to see why. Well, I want you to know I am happy for you. I know that look. You have something on your mind, don't you? Of course. Mm, I have not given this a lot of thought. What will I do? We've traveled far and wide. Does it need to end? There's so much out there. Adventures to be had and stories to be told. I want to be part of it all. I might need some company. And you're not too irritating. You're welcome to come along if you like. It's settled then. You and I, wandering the world, seeking our fortunes, I can't wait. I know that look. You have something on your mind, don't you? Of course. Don't apologize. It is something you felt you needed to do. I cannot question that. And life goes on, yes? I will be alright. Come, let's move on. I know that look. You have something on your mind, don't you? Of course. 
There are many rumors about spies, or lesion or otherwise. What are you referring to exactly? Oh, I see what you're getting at. Honestly? Yes. Why shouldn't I? Violence is not the only solution. People respond eagerly to others who they believe understand them. They seek approval, friendship, sometimes love. This can be exploited. You don't think it is? I took what I wanted from them, leaving them none the wiser and unharmed. It is a game, one that can be won with little bloodshed if one plays well. And crude. Why not make someone want to do what you suggest, instead of forcing them to do it? Everyone can be seduced by the right woman. The trick is predicting who she is and becoming her. Master the game and no one can resist you. That is what they all say. I suppose we will never know, will we? I'm certainly not going to test you. <laughs> that would be something to see. He thinks he'll charm me. I didn't say that. I did say it would be something to see, didn't I? You're an interesting person. Sometimes I don't know what to make of you, but I like it. But come, it is getting late and there is much to be done. I know that look. You have something on your mind, don't you? Of course. 